will be at this all night, Batman. If you haven't stopped me yet, you won't anytime soon. You're not escaping any more, Deathstroke. That ends tonight. If you say so. What is this? Hmm. Arrows. Hello, Slade. Green Arrow. It's been a while. It certainly has. I appreciate the assist, but I can take it from here. Clearly. He belongs in Argus, not any of your prisons here in Gotham. Criminals belong in any prison. Mind helping me make the trip easier? With pleasure. Thanks. You been holding up pretty well? Not a good time for small talk. We need to get him imprisoned quickly. Right. It's just, the League hasn't really heard from you in a while. Almost seemed like you wanted to quit. Batman, you can talk to me. You know that, right? You can talk to any of us. We've all had loss. Flash lost his mom. I lost my father. Arthur has lost Mara. And then there's that prophecy Rip Hunter told Flash about- I'm fine. The prophecy doesn't bother me. We only have one future, and it's whatever we can make it to be. If you say so, just don't be afraid to contact your friends every once in a while, okay? Even Diana's been worried about you, and you know Clark is always willing to talk. I... I met Jason once. Caught him helping Roy out of a situation once. He was a good kid. Thanks. See you around. Hmm, dark, brooding, loss, friends, prophecies. Sounds like an opera. I think I can help with you, Batman. Titan's Foil Brother Blood Plot by Iris West. What do you think? Not bad. Well, it's a good thing they stopped Blood before he made anything worse. Well, that too, but I meant the paper. Not bad for someone's first time writing about the Titans, huh? I'm surprised you're first, considering how much a certain kid member tends to be in our lives. Oh man, Wally's always trying to encourage me to give him as much of a spotlight as I can in these articles. I'm surprised the animal boy hasn't been asking for that too. Believe me, he has. Gets a little annoying. Wally sometimes has to remind me that he's only a teenager after all. Sometimes I forget most of them are teenagers, to be honest. Hello? Earth to Barry? Huh? Oh, sorry, I was just... Thinking? Yeah, thinking. The prophecy? How did you... I'm not intended, but you think I don't notice when you seemed a little slow today? You keep dowsing off like something's on your mind, or like you're hearing voices. Sorry, Iris, it's just been a few years. Every day I go around stopping any normal crime, either by myself or with the League, and I just keep wondering, how long is this going to last? When do I have to up the game? Start making sure the prophecy doesn't immediately begin. Barry, slow down. Again. You of all people know time has a weird way of working with these things. It's best not to worry about the future, but to worry about where we are in this current moment. What we do now, where we go next, you worry about the future too much, and heck, maybe that's how you cause it. Hmm. You sure have a way with words. Hello? Reporter here? Titans together? I'll probably still be writing about these guys five years from now. Who knows how many members will go in and out? 
Seems like the perfect moment for an opening number. What's up with this happy-go-lucky guy? I'm not sure. Ladies and gentlemen, I sense we're all having a good morning today, aren't we? The sun has risen, the morning newspapers are out, you're all getting ready to go to work, and you're all filling up that cash register just for me. Hey, get off, buddy, or I'll call the... Now, 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 oh. it's not professional to interrupt the opening cue. Barry, I think you should... She get changed. Well, that's my man. Come one, come all, we need as many backup dancers as we can. Drop the act! Whoever you are? Flash, how interesting. I've always wanted to meet you, the light-hearted, funny, but worrisome character in this musical called Life. <laughs> yes, you can definitely start us off. I don't know where you're from, but people in coffee shops just want to finish their mornings and hurry on to work. But that's exactly what we're going to be doing today, my friend. We're going to work. Oh, no. What the... My speed should have been able to get you. Who are you? Well, my real name is beyond even your comprehension, but you may call me the Music Meister. And you're just one of three big parts in the grand musical. That's right, Scarlet Speedster. Just rest. You're still needed in the grand scheme of things. You know, it never hurts to take a break from staring at the screen all night. Criminals don't take breaks, Alfred. Criminals are fools who don't know how to properly live their lives, sir. You, on the other hand, have two lives to handle. You work very hard, Master Bruce. Take a night off. Master Dick and his team seem to be handling criminals very well lately. Who do you think taught him how to lead? Sir, please. I've seen the video files of the fight with Deathstroke the other night. You were lucky Green Arrow came when he did. You've been overworking yourself. Can't exactly keep adding more stitches to the same arm now, can we? Just one day, sir. For me. You've been through a lot, Lily. One night won't hurt. Maybe even give Miss Kyle a call. Selena Kyle isn't exactly the most trustworthy person, Alfred. Because you never give her a chance. She's quite proven herself the past year. Maybe she'll turn over a new leaf and... I don't need any more partners, Alfred. You of all people know that. No, sir. What you need are your friends. You're not the only bloody fool who's lost anyone you know. And I'm in no mood to lose more! I miss Master Todd too, sir. But it's no excuse to alienate all your friends. I'll be preparing dinner upstairs if you ever care to have any later. Alfred, I'm... I'm sorry. I'll think about calling her later. I, I didn't mean to yell. Don't apologize to me, sir. Just remember, I'm here. Master Dick and Barbara are here. The League is here. We're all here. You have three new messages. New message received one week ago. Hey! Bruce! Listen. You're a billionaire playboy. I'm a billionaire playboy. Let's take a night out. Just two regular guys going out for drinks. Maybe we can even catch that eclipse coming up in two days. Message deleted. Hmm. He didn't bring that up last night. New message. New message. New message. Hey, buddy. Down on your luck? Bummed out about love? Lost the sun? Alienating all your friends? Like to think about bats? What the? Then come on down to Gotham City Opera House. We're here to lighten your day and shine your life. Make all your worries go away with just a little music and a beat. It's either that or the fate of Gotham. What do you say, Batman? Want to raise your voice? I can't trace the origin of the call anywhere. That's, that's not possible. possible. Oh, my brooding dark knight. It's quite possible. Who are you? Uh, no, no, no. I didn't write any repeats in this part of the score. I'm sorry, but you'll have to ask your friend, The Flash. That is, if you can even talk to him. What have you done to him? Uh, nothing too... serious. If you've hurt him in any way... Now why would I hurt one of my stars? It would be career suicide to do that. This is some type of game to you? Of course not! This is the musical entitled Life. Something you've had quite some time with, I've noticed. I don't sing. 
or dance. Well, then we will have to change that. But aren't you wondering how I found the Batcave? I know you're leaving and never coming back. Maestro, cue number 26, please. Fighting Batman theme song. Who are you talking to? Oh, just my multi-dimensional band that follows me everywhere I go. Prepare to sing like you never have, Bruce. I see you received my invitation. This better be worth it, Savage. If you knew what I was doing... I did know what you were doing, and trust me, it's nothing compared to what you'll be doing here. I certainly hope so. Wait a minute. No, you didn't. I realize he's a very loose cannon, but he is necessary to accomplish the first task. The last time I crossed paths with Meister, we didn't really get along. A few rounds for my weapon fixed that, but we still weren't allies in any way. So what exactly is my task? Your task is to kill the three Justice League members Music Meister is. Well, trapping in their own prisons. Once they are completely taken over by Meister's ability, you will kill them. Should be simple enough, I hope. Simple it is. You got it, Savage. Find anything? I didn't know you were still in Gotham. Overwatch got a distress message not too long ago. It came from here. Figured you'd need my help again. You're welcome. What do you know about the music, Meister? People are gonna call themselves anything nowadays. And that he doesn't want Dinah as one of his singers. Flash is being held prisoner. My only clue to his location was to come here. But the whole place is empty. Just props from a previous show. Ready when you are. Now! Well, well, well. Could have just called me if you wanted to play. What are you doing here, Catwoman? Got a nice tip that one of the producers wanted to be a little too realistic with this show. Guess he thought real diamonds was fancier than plastic. Seemed like a chance to score. Not sure if I don't buy it, or buy it since it's Gotham. Oh, haven't seen you in a while either, Arrow. Arm still working like a pro? I know I gave them quite the workout last I saw you. Go home, Catwoman. I don't have time for this. Is that really what you'd say to an old friend, Batman? Not even a, how you've been? You get used to it. Hmm. <laughs> you used to be fun. You're not gonna find anything of use here at the opera. Meister's not in tonight. Not yet, that is. How much do you know? Meister apparently has a special place for you two and the Flash. Individually. Somewhere that each of you have felt pain before in. A house. A boat. An alley. Barry's house. My accident. Crime alley. Meisters knows who we all are. How? Why are you telling us this? Believe it or not, Batman, I want to help. You? The woman who was part of a criminal group a couple years back? I did ask about your arms, didn't I? The Injustice League was fun while it lasted, but it was never going to last. Meister wants all three of you separated before his big final act. He won't know what's coming if you had an extra partner to guide you in one of the locations. What does he have? Hmm? Well, obviously, just the Flash for now I- I meant from you. Your story's a bluff. You would have already gotten out of here with the diamonds if you were looking for them. Hmm. I guess you still know me well. Alright, look. I don't know if you've noticed, but Meister has a locket around his neck. It's mine. I want it back. A locket? Really? It's mine. I want it back. Meister wanted me to play this game of his, and I wasn't having it. Next thing you know, I woke up without a locket. Help me get it back, and I'll help you with stopping Meister. Not exactly your style. Yeah, well, things change. You want my help or not? She is the only one who has detailed information on this music, Meister. You can't be serious. Trust me. I don't want to work with her more than you do. But when you have someone with the information you need, you take it. <sighs> you can help us, Catwoman. 
But if you so much as pull even the smallest double cross, I'll make sure you spend the rest of your days in a padded cell at the Arkham Institute. Do I make myself clear? You really do take all the fun out of things, don't you? Ugh, fine. Where is the Meister now? Don't know. He was rather persistent on keeping me in the dark on things. The locket. What exactly was it? I already told you it was mine. What more do you want from me? What you had inside it. Inside it? What are you talking about? Three days ago, a rare multi-dimensional gem went missing from the Gotham Museum. The GCPD have yet to find it, though I figure that's because the gem is small enough to fit inside a locket. Well, I guess they call you the greatest detective for a reason. What do you need with that? And don't say it was shiny. Fine. For the past week, I've been dealing with this guy who's from the fifth dimension or something. He offered me a ring and marriage in order for everything to remain the same. But his name was, well, rather difficult to speak. Mixopidilic. Yeah, that's him. How did you know? Superman has encountered him before. So has Supergirl. From their experiences, I logged everything I could about him, in case I ever needed it again. Anywhere in those logs say how to get rid of him? You have to get him to say his name backwards. That's it? That'll be easier than trying to find the rare glacier diamond once thought to be in Central City. It's not as easy as you think it is. I hope things work out for you. Arrow, we have work to do. We certainly do. Hey Arrow man, if you ever want to know what real fun is, give me a call. Ugh, how do you deal with her? I have my ways. Well, anytime you want to let me know, that'd be great. Focus. We need to find... Gas mask, quick! No, 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 Batman. Now that would be cheating. Batman? Batman? I... Batman! I get... Wait your turn, Arrow. Right now is about the bat and the cat. Crime Alley. Why? Oh, Batman, I know a lot about you Justice Leaguers. I've noticed. But what I really don't get is how a man who knows loss just wants to keep letting himself lose more. I mean, first your parents, then the Riddler, now your latest Robin, you would think this would make you appreciate the people around you more. But instead, you just want to keep on losing. You see what I mean, Batman? Coward! Really, that's all you're gonna say, not Catwoman, are you alright? She just tried to attack me for you. Least you could do is show some concern for her. Seriously, Batman, have you ever once considered getting to know her more? Get your hands off me! Speed Force. Oh, you don't mind if I borrow that from your friend for a bit, do you? I just really want to help you, Batman. You don't open up. You don't talk. You've gone through so much loss in your life. And you talk too much! The two of you together would be such a good couple. Opposite sides of the law. Your own versions of law. Batman, why do you ignore such a good woman for your heart? Maybe it would help if you knew her better. No! Selena? That's right, Batman. Your little kitty is none other than Selena Kyle. I'm surprised you didn't figure that out earlier, to be honest. Uh, guess something's up with my timeline book. Ain't she a beauty, Batman? Now you can finally ask her questions and get to know her better. Hey, Selina, did you know Batman here lost a young partner, too? Shut up. Oh, come on, kitty. I'm just trying to be both your wingmans. You, of all people, should know what it's like to grow up with a young friend and have them taken away by a criminal. Shut up! Catwoman, stop! Touch her again and I'll break you. Finally! 
Batman showing care. Now that's one way to get to a woman's heart indeed, Batman. Showing that you care about her. Showing that you can relate to her. But let's do the next step now. You know, Batman, women also love it when you save them from the bad guys. I guess I'll be playing that role tonight. But they also love a man who can sing. Tell me, Batman, can you sing? I Oh, what's that, Batman? I couldn't hear you. I do not sing. Hmm. Needs work, but let's do this. Does it ever keep you up at night? To know that one day that could be your future? You might find me annoying, Batman, but deep down, I'm just a friend who wants to help you. Someone who wants to make sure you make more friends after me. Here. The locket. Do you want to know how much in common you and Selina here have? Put it down. Begging, are we, Selina? That almost sounded like vulnerability. Please. Please put it down. Selena, you're... Crying? Tell me, Batman. What did she tell you about this fancy locket? Or did you just jump to conclusions about what it is? It's holding a rare multidimensional gem that went missing from GCPD. Mrs. Pitalik wanted her hand in marriage. Rare multidimension gem? Mrs. Pitalik? Whoa, whoa, whoa. She really did not want you to know, did she? First of all, you see my other necklace here. The gem! Second... Mixus Pitalik is a friend of mine, and word going around is that he wants to avoid this dimension for some time. Says they're already going to have lots of rings going around. You want to know what's inside this locket? Picture. You and a girl. That girl was my friend, Holly. We grew up together, orphans, hung out in bad crowds, watched each other's back, she wore that locket all the time. Then one day, she was kidnapped. Some tall man with a beard. I screamed for him to let her go. He called her too dangerous. And then he stabbed... And then he stabbed her and got away. I was alone with her and the cops were coming. I couldn't even explain to them what happened. They would have thought I killed her. I didn't want to leave her behind. I didn't, so I had to take the locket. I needed something of her. Anything. I couldn't even help them bury the body. She was... she was practically my sister. I... Now, didn't that feel good, Selena? Opening your heart up? Everyone has a vulnerability. Man, Batman, for the world's greatest detective, you sure can't figure out women. Every time Catwoman does just the smallest thing, you just assume, oh, once a thief, always a thief. Am I right? When the reality of the situation is, you didn't even bother to consider that maybe, just maybe, she was afraid. Afraid to open up, show a weakness. But deep down, you're the same. You feel her pain. You know what that's like. Go on, tell her. Tell her about Robin. Go on, do it. By the end of this night, Meister, you better hope one of the other leaguers stops you. Because you don't want me to. <sighs> I guess you still need some work. Here you go, Selena. Deal's a deal. You can go home. Batman, I guess you still need some work. No matter, I'll just show you next to your buddy Flash for now. The next act is going to have a very St. Patrick's Day feel. Batman. Uh, oh man. Not in the mood. Batman! Batman, are you there? Let's see. The rest of the league is busy. 
Arsenal is with the Titans. Overwatch! You there? Pretty Bird, what about you? Hello? This thing has to be jammed. Whoa, sorry I took a while, Mr. Queen. Had to play a wingman for a bit. Didn't go too well. Mr. Queen? Yes, yes, I know all your identities, blah, blah, blah. They're not really that hard to figure out. At least for me, it isn't. Where's Batman? Oh, don't worry. He's with Flash right now. You'll see both of them soon. Right now, I just want to talk. My God, you hero types always this quick to action? Seriously. You kidnapped two of my friends and jammed my communicator. I wanted to talk to each and every one of you one by one. That, and I can't let you call that canary woman to scream my ears out. Sheesh. But fair point. That was rude of me. So I do apologize. Thanks, I guess? Anyways, though, that's not why I'm here to talk. You see, I've already had plenty of convos tonight with your buddies. You, man, you and I need to talk too, of course. How do you do it? You were stranded on an island for how long, and yet... You can still smile every day and hang out with beautiful women? Life goes on. Past just a scar that helps you decide your future so you don't get another one. Why do you want to know so much about me? Correct me if I'm wrong, but out of the three of you, you, Mr. Queen, just seem like the most relaxed, the most chill, the one with a bigger sense of humor. I have my broody moments. But that's not what's important right now, Ollie. What's important right now is this. You are the key to saving your friends. Not just physically, but emotionally. You're a guidance to them, a glimmer of hope. Where are you going with this? Oliver, I want you to show your friends that... Huh. Odd, that's... No! No, 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 no! You're not in my musical, no! Intruder on the stage, I will not have this. Odd. Green Arrow? Green Arrow! Arrow, are you there? Iris? Iris, come in! Oh, thank God. I've been trying to contact the League all night. Where's Barry? We haven't found him yet. Batman's missing too. How do you even get this line? Star Labs. Cisco usually keeps building spare communicators in case Barry's ever gets damaged. You will not believe how many he's already gone through. Hey Cisco, you guys have any way of tracking Flash? Maybe Batman too? We've been fighting this music meister all night. He seems to have developed Flash's super speed too. Ran off in quite a hurry too. Intruder on the stage apparently? Could it be where he's keeping Flash and Batman? Flash's suit usually has a tracker for us to keep an eye on him at all times, but the signal disappeared right after Meister took him from the cafe. What about Batman? Man, I wish I had a tracker on that guy. You know? Not in the creepy way, that is. Just in the, where does this guy sleep at night way. You know? I I'll just shut up now. Actually, I could really use you to keep talking, Cisco. You and Iris. We bumped into Catwoman tonight. Catwoman? She's in this too? She actually tried to help us. We don't know how, but Meister knows who all three of us are. He wanted to talk to each of us personally, in a place very important to our past. Jitter's Cafe is where Barry and I had our first date and crime scene discussions. Batman's area Meister had to have already gone to since he's missing too. For me, he's got to be somewhere near boats. Star City Docks. There's an old building there that used to be run by the manager until the company was bought out by Stag Industries. Maybe there. One way to find out. Yo, Arrow. Need me to contact anybody to send in for help? If this Meister guy has flash of speed and could take down Batman, you could be walking into a death trap. So is someone else. I don't think he's friends with Meister either. Mm. No! Dad, no! He didn't do it! Please, he didn't do it! Hang on now, I'll get you out. Aw oh, man, how does this work? It works if you just shoot his head. I don't believe we've met. Be glad we haven't. Get him out of this trance now, or I'll persuade you to. Green Arrow threatening me? Well, isn't that a nice joke? Get out of my way, or I'll kill you too. Never! Well, if that's the way you want it... Hiding will only get your friend here closer to his death. That's if you actually kill him. 
Oh, an interesting tactic. Useless against me, though. This armor can take material ten times stronger than your arrows, unless you have something stronger. Stop wasting my time and just let me kill the Flash. Let's settle this. Mano y mano. Winner gets the Flash. No weapons, but physical combat. Hmm, it's a tempting offer. One I would usually accept, however. I'm on a bit of a schedule, so I'll have to decline. I was hoping for that. Get out of this! <laughs> you really think this will stop me? Man, that guy really just likes to kill, doesn't he? Oliver, that'll do nothing to me. Besides, I'm not the one trying to kill your friends. You haven't really convinced me of that yet, so start talking! How do I get them out of this trance? I'm afraid we're not at that part of the musical. We... Brooding moment, I see. I'm tired of your games. I want answers now, or I leave you to that guy back there. Who? Kronos? Don't make me laugh. I could take her without even trying. But that's not in my script. Or is it? Always changing and rearranging. You know how it is, us musicians in our show. More answers now! All right, all right, I'll help you. But only because the answer you seek isn't exactly easy to complete. What do you mean? Well, the way to get Bruce and Barry out of the trance that they are in is to actually enter the world I've trapped them in. Now I know you have a friend who can vibe. Cisco, I believe his name is. He's vibed into the worlds before, but never again. Are you sure that's the only way to wake them? Well, there is one other way, but... Well, it's about freaking time. What took you so long? Trumpet Meister. Green Arrow. Long time no see. Step aside. Final warning. I would listen to him. It's not often he gives last warnings to his victims. My offer of combat is still on the table. A dance number? Oh my, Mr. Queen, you are very quick on your feet. <laughs> Sorry, I just realized who you have and how I have his powers. I don't dance, and I'm afraid your musical production is shut down. Oh, nonsense. The show must go on. How dare you punch me? This face took me centuries to perfect, and now it's ruined. I have to look good for the show or it's all downhill. Oh, sorry, Oliver. You'll have to excuse us for a moment. That's it. I'm done. Savage may have hired me to help you, but screw that. It's about time you get what's been coming for a long time. That was very enjoyable. The fun ends there. This little feud is over. Man, I kind of prefer your helmet on over seeing your actual face. Dang. Bart, I'm so sorry. Who the heck is Bart? Mm, man, that man had quite a bit of anger built up over me. How are you still alive? It's hard to explain. You know, you shouldn't carry dead weight with you. It only slows you down. Either you tell me how to really get him out of this trance, or you leave me alone. All right, fine. No more reveals, no more songs and dances, just hard, cold reality. Barry and Bruce won't wake up until they've realized the worlds they are in aren't real. That's not very helpful. You made their worlds to seem lifelike. Yes, I did. Thank you for noticing my work. I am this close to shoving an arrow right through your head right now. Release them now, or it'll make your time here very unpleasant. See, I would, but... I'm kind of working for a guy who, let's be honest, can take all of you on at win. Vandal Savage, yeah, I heard. And that doesn't scare you? I've faced him before. With help, of course. Well, he's got the perfect plan to take down the League, and he doesn't even have to lay a finger on any of you. He has others to do that. Maybe you and I can make a deal. If I can guarantee you safety from Savage. <laughs> you... Protect me from him. Right, right. Plus, I am a being of infinite power, so I have a better chance of defending myself from him than you of protecting me. If that's so, then how come you're so afraid of him? Let's just say he may know my weakness. Batman is the smartest and best fighter I know. If you free him, 
he can make sure Savage never uses your weakness against you. Hmm, well, you're not wrong. But see, even if I free him, the place he's in, well, let's just say it isn't the nicest of places to be. Release them and we'll get him, no matter the cost. All right. But as you said, the worlds they were in were very lifelike. So they may come out a bit, well, not like themselves. One step at a time. What the? Where am I? You! You did this to me! I'm terribly sorry. I, I was kind of under pressure, too. Green Arrow? You're with him? I got him to release you and Batman. He's decided to back off trying to take us down. Is this true? Are you really going to back off? Yes, but only because I now realize that you, all of you, are enough to stop what is coming. Savage's plan will start very soon. You don't have much time. Beware the year 2019, as it brings nothing but destruction and loss. Rip Hunter told us Savage defeated the League. Is that what happens? If what he plans to do happens, then you all are destined to die before you even have a chance to stop him. I must be going, though. This has been fun. Perhaps we could do this again. No! no! Dang, tough crowd. You're still here. Well, I guess I get to kill both of you now. I was going to kill Flash in his trance, but I think being alive when I kill you will be more satisfying. You do realize who I am, right? The fastest man alive? Yeah. I know someone else who claims that. At least he's worthy of my time. Probably the only speedster I can actually get behind. Wait a minute, you're talking about Thawne. Didn't he escape from Star Labs? Yeah, by the help of Abracadabra. That's enough! Take your deaths with pride. Usually my victims are dead by now, so you've lasted longest out of everyone I've hunted. The hunt ends here. The hunt is always on. Whoa, little warning next time. Yeah, sorry. You think taking my weapon will save you? You're greatly mistaken. We need to find Batman. Batman, do you read? All right, Reach. Where are you? We're currently at the docks in Star City. Where are you at? I'm not sure. But something tells me if I stay here any longer, I may never leave. Wait, I think I know where he is. What? Ow! Just call it a hunch. Come on. Oh no, I'm taking my ride. No Speedster Express for me. We're on our way. Hang in there, Bruce. I think he's here. Are you sure? This place doesn't really seem like it would be able to hold someone prisoner anymore. I'm sure, Oliver. Trust. Um, friend of yours? I'm not quite sure. Interesting. Did you happen to see who got you out of there? Ask him yourself. He's right behind you. I just have to say, it's an honor to meet you all. Especially you, Grandfather. Grandfather? What, who are you? Oh, right. I'm Bart Allen, or Impulse. I realize seeing your great-grandson is a bit to take in, but I wouldn't have come if it wasn't urgent. What's happened? This guy, who goes by the name of Vandal Savage, has taken over the world with the help of his team of time-traveling villains. I was lucky to make it here. It's coming true. The warning Rip gave us. We need to find Savage. Now. There is this one thing I should mention. Or maybe I shouldn't. Future information. Hard to tell what is right to tell or not. It's really crash, to be honest. Crash? Yeah, just kinda something I say. If this warning about Savage is already in play, we need to assemble the League and find Savage now and his new team. I'll meet you back at headquarters. Gotta make a quick stop. Understood. Hey there, Bruce. Selena. You're alright. Well, after seeing you the way I did, I couldn't just simply stay away now, could I? Selena. The League. They need me right now. But I don't want to pretend what happened tonight didn't happen. In a weird, twisted way, Maestro was right. Ever since I lost Robin, I've been distancing myself from others. Ignoring the fact I'm not the only one who suffered a loss. You've suffered one too. I... I want to be able to help you, Selena Kyle. Hopefully, you can help Bruce Wayne as well. Well, aren't you the charmer? I have an apartment downtown. 
you should stop by. An outfit or no outfit, I have no preference. The mission needs me one more time tonight. If I don't help the League right now, all of Gotham or the world could be lost. I can't have any more losses. Especially you. Right. Well, when you're done playing dress-up, come find me. I'm always a rooftop away. <sighs> Crash! You and Catwoman? How long has that been a thing? Must you eavesdrop on everything? Sorry, it's just an impulse I can't control. Get it? My name's Impulse and... Man, he is rather cold-blooded, isn't he? Yeah, that's kind of normal for him. Well, should we head to HQ? I suppose your knowledge of the future may prove useful. Right. There's something I should tell you. Yeah? When I ran back to this point in time, I was being pursued by one of Savage's enforcers. His name was Epoch. Uh, okay, so you're saying that he might come back like you? He had not only the ability to travel through time, but he ran what used to be a prison that stood outside of time itself. It used to have the world's greatest villains, until Savage persuaded him to help with his plans and release all of the villains. How many villains no were there? No one was ever able to find out. But off of rumors, at least a hundred. Maybe more. We need to warn the rest of the League. Come on! You got it, Pops. <laughs> well, it certainly looks like you lost your touch, eh, Cronus? Uh, Kadabra. Interesting to see you here. Are you with Savage as well? What? Well, of course. Speaking of... He's waiting for you back at HQ. I may not have killed the League members. But I did learn one thing. Their true identities. Which I'm sure Savage will be most pleased with. After you. Thank you. You better have something good for me or else your lifespans will be reduced immediately. I may have failed, Vandal. But I succeeded in another way. I know who all the League members are under their masks and suits, thanks to Meister. Ah, now that is good news. You have served your purpose, Kronos. We will update your equipment and prepare you for what's to come. Thank you. Should I get Thawne? Yes, it seems we are ready to proceed. We just need one more. Well, it seems your taste in headquarters never change. And who exactly are you? How did you know where I had my base? Oh, I know quite a bit about you, Vandal. My name is Epoch, and I'm from the future and quite literally a man out of time. You haven't officially met me yet, but I felt things needed a bit of an acceleration. What is so important that you come from the future to this point now? In the future, you enslave this world because of the villains I release from a prison that resides outside of the time stream. However, even with the Justice League taken out, there are still resistors. And one in particular has also returned to this time period, to warn the League, I would assume. I'm here to make sure the League never gets a fighting chance and that you keep your rule of this planet. Well, that's a very interesting offering, but I can handle things myself. What, with your team of time travelers who have all lost against the heroes? Eobard Thon, Reverse Flash, lost to the Flash. Abracadabra, also lost to the Flash. Kronos, taken down by Green Arrow. Your team is filled with people unable to stop the thing that stands in their way. Me, on the other hand, single-handedly caught most of the world's villains and put them away. Until you showed me a better and more fun way to life, I think it's time you used your secret weapon. Assuming she's ready. Oh, she is, aren't you, my dear? I'm ready to kill the League. Then do we start? The time approaches then. The fall of the League begins today. And the rule of Vandal Savage will reign over all. How awesome, my dear. Yeah, I can't wait to see you again. And to kill ya. <laughs>